Hey guys, welcome back to another video and today I have an amazing product in front of me. As you all know, DJI have launched this new product, their palm size drone, which is the DJI Neo and it's making waves in the industry and we got our hands on on this amazing product and this is what we're going to talk about today. And as you guys can see, we already unboxed it, we were flying it, we have a lot of fun with it. Even we went for the launch of this product in Singapore and we got to try hands on before it even came out to the market so it was an amazing experience and we have the fly more combo package and this one comes with a lot of things as you guys can see i can read through the box we have the aircraft itself definitely then it comes with the three batteries one two and three one one is inside then we have the propeller guards which will be inside so you can fix them here just like that then we have the remote control comes with the type c cable to charge the batteries or the drone itself then we have a screwdriver some extra propellers and of course all the instruction manuals and guides which you need to know how to fly this drone and apart from that of course we have a charging hub where you can actually charge all three batteries at the same time which is amazing so this drone comes in different packages like for example we have a combo which i told you about but you can actually just get this near itself the whole point of this drone is that if you are not familiar with flying drones or you don't know how to do that actually this one is you just put on your palm or anywhere and press a couple of buttons and set up the settings it will fly and follow you and do a lot of things which we will talk about all the functionalities in a bit and this drone is also compatible with a lot of other dji products for example fpv goggles you can have that and you can control that as well okay if we talk about the build quality of this thing this is a very solid drone it's very light only 135 grams and it's really very 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 light and you can throw it around trust me the build quality is amazing we were flying it we hit the walls and here and there uh, <laughs> during our testing <laughs> and it, it it still looks amazing there is no damage on this and uh, especially for the propellers which are covered that's the best part about it then the of course the controllers i think if you guys know about dji products the quality of the products in terms of the controllers and all these things amazing very solid build here and of course all the other accessories comes in a very high and premium build quality as well so before we put this on the test and fly it around and have some fun let's talk about these features and all the specifications of this drone the DJI Neo is an ultra portable drone weighing just 135 grams making it one of the lightest model in DJI's lineup. It features a 12 megapixel camera with half inch image sensor delivering crisp 4K video at 30 frames per second and 1080p at 60 frames per second for smoother motion capture. The camera comes equipped with a wide f-stop 2.8 aperture and an ultra wide 14mm equivalent lens ensuring bright detailed images even in low light. The Neo boasts AI-driven features like subject tracking and six different quick shot modes. These smart modes allow users to capture complex cinematic footage with ease. The drone's single axis mechanical gimbal tilts up 60 degree and down 90 degree for flexible shooting angles, stabilizing by DJI Rocket Steady and Horizon balancing technologies for smooth, stable video even in motion. It supports palm launch gesture control and even voice commands letting you start recording or execute quick shots hands-free the neo has a flight time of up to 18 minutes and it's powered by a 1435 milliamps battery and includes 22 gb of internal storage the maximum range of the dji neo is 7 kilometers and it can resist wind up to 18 miles per hour all right guys so we are going to demonstrate and test this drone right now here we choose to do it inside in our studio. I just wanted to show that even in the small spaces like this, it's very safe to uh, fly. And of course, outside, you know, there are no limits <laughs> as long as you follow all the rules. In Singapore, especially, first of all, without any app or remote control, turn it on, of course. And then there are a few modes on it. So I'll press one by one each mode. There are six modes on it. So you can hear it from my microphone also because this one is says that which mode you are on as well. Then after that, we will do a uh, flying. So for example, uh, I will press this button on the top. Drony. It says Drony. And the second one, third circle. one? Third one is the circle. Rocket. Rocket mode. Spotlight. Spotlight mode we have. Boomerang. Boomerang mode we have. But what we're gonna do, we're gonna, we're gonna go back to the first one, which is the follow mode. 
and what we're gonna do we're gonna just put here uh, just just make sure you put it in front of your face so it can track you as well so you need to hold this top button to start the flying so i'm gonna hold it for two seconds okay two one there we go as you guys can see how simple it was it did noisy because of the propellers but it's doing a very good job if i move here see it just follows me and then if i move here it will be just following me whatever i will do it will just come and find me wherever i am so we can see some obstacles it auto avoids these obstacles as well so okay then <laughs> very cool and then i bring my palm under it so it will just land like that so how it does that there are two sensors under it so this is where any palm you put under it it will just come and land itself this is how you can just outdoor also just put it on the follow mode and you can do you are doing a cycling you can do anything it will just follow your running also we have done some testing about running inside the office as well it works very very well um, and it try to avoid all the obstacles uh, in its way or if it really cannot follow you it just stops there all right the second mode i will try the droney mode here this is supposed to be well i will be walking towards the uh, drone it should go backwards it's like a selfie mode something like that so let's try that let's see how that performs 10 meters, Three. Ten meters drone Three. that's what it says all right so let's say yeah this is working very well okay <laughs> <laughs> so that's why it says 10 meter drone because it goes all the way backwards so uh, until 10 meter so now we know so th these are the modes so there are few modes you can uh, you guys can see on the screen so you can use all these how you can utilize indoor and outdoor and amazing amazing uh, footages you can get in 4k quality okay so the next thing i'm gonna do i'm gonna connect this with this remote control uh, then fly with this all right so i have connected with my mobile and the remote control uh, which comes with it and then as you guys can see on my mobile uh, there is uh, all set up the connection was straightforward and then from there i just press go fly and you guys can see here now all the footages whichever i can see is inside here it makes the things very simple and it gives you a lot of control also on the drone that how you want to do it so for example there are a lot of other information uh, inside i can press the recording button here to start recording the footage from here uh, let's say so it's started uh, already and then i can just turn on and start the drone like that holding these two buttons like that it's uh i can move it around i can get all the footage i need <laughs> so i can see here look i can see myself and uh, i can go move it around it gives a very nice control it's very smooth it's very responsive as well at the same time so i can see the map on the left side also um, then I will just go back to press this button. I will say land the aircraft in the current location. There we go. I'll put my hand here. Alright, so the next thing, uh, I want to try this function button. Uh, of course, this function button, when you press it, it, it moves the camera, if you guys can see. Like, if I press this function button, it brings it forward and it downwards as well. Uh, the other thing is, right, if I'm flying this, uh, this will give me a uh, footage of the drone on the screen also it tells me where the drone should go so let me bring it up so let's say as you guys can see on the screen that i can see this mark on the drone so i will try to land it at this mark itself and i will press land here and it's going to land here <laughs> this app provides you a lot of functionality it makes your drone more easier to fly around all right so let's move to the next part where we can just control this with the app only itself don't even need a remote control or anything so let's try that part all right guys so now what we're gonna do we're gonna just use the mobile to control this for for example if you guys can see from the drop down i can use the manual control follow drony circle rocket spotlight and uh, boomerang so i can just choose it from here it will do it there it will help me uh, follow that way 
then from the other part is also have a voice control so if i say something here it will actually do this we will demo that one also we will take off with this voice control then after that there's a microphone also this is what a very good feature about this app if you are using this to record you can use your phone as a microphone and it will emit all the other sounds also and give you a very clear quality of the sound as well okay so i'm on the manual mode now i will use the voice control to make it take off okay let's see if that works for us take off yeah that's good so um very nice i have all the controls here whatever we have used in the remote control also so which is good so let me land this okay so now i'm gonna use the follow mode to do it i just need to put so it can see myself and then i will be using the microphone here to record the audio as well so let me take off first then we will uh, use that okay all right so as you guys can see on my screen also it says it's recording and it's taking the audio from my microphone so which is very good also the same thing if you are going further away from it your sound or everything it look remains very good imagine you are outdoor you are very very far away and then you are uh, doing it uh, shoot for like a hill or something it will still give you a very good audio quality from your microphone and is auto start and auto stop the recording which is also a very good function i hope you guys have enjoyed this video and i tried my best to cover all the amazing features of this amazing drone and if you guys want to know more about this product i will be dropping the links in the description or you want to know more about it anything just let me know in the comment section also i'll be happy to reply all of you and if you guys have enjoyed this video don't forget to drop a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel i'll see you guys in the next video until then take care and bye bye